Hi friends, welcome back to my channel Testing Mini Bytes. I am your friend Amudan Shaktivel, and in this video, uh, you know we are not going to see anything new, but you know this video is for people who are requested me uh, to create an online training course for AP automation. Right? You all know how important is AP automation these days. There are a lot of jobs you know that demands AP automation. Right? Whether some some people request you to know Postman, some people request you to do it with SOAP UI, some people use REST Assure. and you know what i am trying to do i am not going to you know separate these into different different courses but i am going to take all of them at once right so you going to learn the api basics what is api what is web services you know how these are different what is rest what is crude operations you know how rest and soap what are what are the difference between all these things right so you you need to have a very sound basics right i am going to work on that and after that we going to use postman to do a lot of manual testing we're going to play around with a lot of mock apis we're going to try out a lot of other apis uh, you know that are open source and we'll try to use that in our code and we'll try to once we done with the manual testing using postman we're going to automate the same using the postman right postman is a very very powerful tool guys if you are a beginners and you you don't have much knowledge with automation or, or even if you have a lot of knowledge with automation uh, doing things with rest issue takes a lot of time right but with postman you, it's all in place you just need to go you can automate almost 100 apis within two days right it gives you very beautiful reports if you try to integrate with newman it has a lot of cool snippets javascript snippets and then it also has a lot of good session libraries you can do rest, you know schema validations with postman there are a lot of things you can do with postman marking and then you can also do uh documentation using postman so we're going to cover all of that right so we're going to cover an extensive piece of thing with postman uh not just postman right suppose if you go to a new job that may they may use soapy way at the time you should not tell okay i don't know soapy way i'm going to teach about soapy way we're going to learn how we can do the manual testing using soapy way also we're going to learn how we can use soapy way and groovy scripting i'm not going to you know use their paid version uh, but we're going to use soapy way free version and then we're going to write some simple codes in groovy scripting don't worry guys you don't have to know a lot of groovy scripting if you know a little bit of java you can you can manage uh, with that it shouldn't be a problem we're going to do a lot of automation using soapy way it is also a very powerful tool it's used across many companies it's it's mandated that you need to know about it at the end we also learn about rest assure right that's the that's the main agenda we also do that apart from that right uh, we you know more details about the course you know the course is going to start on 27th uh, july okay and we you know we we have the timings from uh, 7 am to 7:45 am ist timing and uh, i choose morning time because we all will be fresh uh we will be able to uh, digest uh, new stuff in in the morning so we, i prefer doing it in the morning time now we are going to have classes on tuesday wednesday then we'll have a break on thursday so that you guys can revise what we learn on the tuesday and wednesday and then you can revise it on the thursday if you have doubts you can also clarify it on the thursday then you can come back and uh, you know learn the new stuff on this friday and saturday take rest for a couple of days and then come back again on the tuesday after practicing what you have learned so I, so my intention is not to rush through things and then cover all the topics i go slow we want to cover everything and most importantly you know you guys need to learn right that's the intention so that's why i am giving enough breaks even if you need another one day break we'll also do that because uh, at the end of the day you 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 need to have sufficient time to practice and ask me doubts and then learn with me okay don't think like guys uh, you know i want to leave you like that so i will at least i will push you to learn it okay so don't worry so that's why you know the maximum participant i'll try to keep it as in a very limited numbers 25 plus 2 and this two members is for people who don't have jobs uh, who has lost jobs due to covid or due to some other personal reason and or suppose uh, you know maybe some some woman who has took some maternity break and they now want to join back to uh, you know come back to into the it field okay all those people you can still reach out to me uh, you guys can pay just 1000 rupees for the entire course uh, previously i was giving it for free but people uh, you know were, was not using it properly they come back they attend one or two session they go they not attending properly so that's why i want to set a minimum limit for 1000 rupees and for others it's it's 10000 rupees and uh, it's for first come and first serve who comes first you guys get the access uh, you know to the online trading course others need to wait for the next batch 
so uh, you know so please uh, if you have the interest to learn some you know, stuff please reach out to me and fill the google form that i leave it in the description of this particular video good and you know i am going to teach about all these things okay java test chunji rest assured assert j assert j is a brilliant uh, association library and uh, we also learn about soap py postman extend reports uh, we going to re do extra reading we going to do the data driven approach using csv as well as json file normally people only teach the excel one but excel is now you know people are getting away from the excel so we'll also learn about csv and json we'll also see about jackson libraries and and its cool annotations we'll also create our own custom annotations right maybe you you will not understand all these things for now but yeah uh, you know if you if you know at least what we are we are we are going to cover a lot of topics if you guys if you are someone who who expect you know to learn you know uh, you know very basics and don't want to i know cover in detail and this this might not be a course i am going to take it you from very basics to the very expert level this is the level that i know okay so you going to be like me after this course so that's what i can guarantee right you going to do a lot of uh, uh, experimentation with faker api availability is one of the cool library we going to learn about that uh, we will also do json schema validation we going to learn about lumbak plugin it will come very handy in rust assured we going to see a lot of utilities that are available in apache commons we going to see about that and this time we going to build you know docker image for our uh, test automation suite we will also learn about docker what is docker image how we can build our docker file how you know all those things okay we're going to cover in everything in detail and we're also going to learn about a lot of design patterns how it can help you to write better and clean code right and this is one of the main key topic where you want to purchase this or you know you want to attend this training you're going to learn how we can develop your rest api using spring boot okay spring boot is nowadays getting you know foot path into the test automation i thought why i cannot and a lot of people asked me why why they are going for spring boot so i took it as a you know challenge i want to pe teach people this is an optional section but you know this will give you a lot of idea how to create rest api if you want to do a lot of marking you want to play around with the apis you don't have to go for external libraries you can you can create your own right very simple we going to see about that you going to get a lot of understanding about the spring boot with this and you know these are all the course section right i'm going to speak about microservices why there is a need for rest assured what is the difference between monolithic all the basics right and the postman and soap py a lot of reporting we going to do reporting with soap py as well we going to you know do everything with related to api automation right we are also going to learn the basics we also be very comfortable if i am i am pretty much sure if you know all these things you can clear any interview okay so that's the amount of guarantee that i can give to you right so this is the top most uh, course what i can take okay i am not leaving some topics i have i am covered almost everything what i know okay related to api automation so we're going to learn about builders builder builder design pattern you know we're going to learn about availability data provider we're going to learn it in detail also j lumba you know jackson annotation listeners in test ng uh, you know we're going to see about the singleton design pattern as well we're going to learn about docker and spring boot previously in the previous course what i took i didn't learn up, you know taught teach about docker and uh, spring boot but this time i'm going to do that hey guys um so meeting the online training course will be conducted in zoom and then the video recording will be uh, you know uploaded and then you can always have a look at it if you could not attend the session due to some other reasons maybe you can watch the video and then come back on the next session right you are free to ask whatever the doubts you have i will not restrict you or i will not uh, you know say don't ask me doubts in the session okay you have to ask doubts and then that, that's the only reason i'm taking this course okay so good if you have still any doubts you can reach out to me in this testing mini bytes at gmail.com or whatsapp me uh, this particular number i will also leave i will also leave the google form in the youtube description as well as i will add it in the in the in the section here so you can fill the google form so please i know fill it if you are really interested to join okay i don't want to encourage people who fill it and then attend you know 10 classes then they tell okay i have attended off of the session uh, due to some reason i want to withdraw okay they are okay to pay 10000 rupees but uh, what i am telling okay uh, you you earned it you know 10000 rupees after you know lot of struggles right why do you want to do that so if you are really interested to learn then 
pay the amount come here i'll definitely try to teach you okay good i i i hope i have explained everything about this course if you still have doubts please reach out to me here or this number please do whatsapp don't call me um, you know uh, please respect my privacy as well so that's all i have to say you guys i will see you guys in another great video if you, if you you know we'll we'll still keep posting a lot of videos about java 8 and design patterns in the youtube okay uh, but for someone who just want to come you know attend my online training course this is the this is the time for you guys thank you i'll see you in another great video tata bye bye